This is a video on flare and copper tubing. So often out in the field, uh, no longer for refrigeration, but sometimes when we're repairing a water line or a humidifier, it's necessary to make a flare joint. So the first thing we're going to do is take our copper tubing after we deburred it and place it in the flaring block. Make sure you match it up to the correct size. And you're going to put it up about an eighth inch higher than the block. To tighten it down securely, place your yoke over it, get it centered, and then start tightening it down. After you get it tightened down, remove it. Take your tubing out of the block. Take your flare knot and move it up. The flare should cover the entire bottom part of the flare knot, the unthreaded part. Before you make the next flare, remember to put your flare knot on your tubing. It's a very sad day to make a perfect flare on the second time, only to look down and see your flare knot still sitting on the bench.